हेलो एंड वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल सो टुडे वी आर हियर अगेन विद कल्ट क्लासिक्स हैदराबाद एंड वी हैव दिस न्यू बी 650 ए सिक्स फिफ्टी गोल्ड स्टार्स हियर लाइंड अप इन ब्लैक दिस वन इज इन रेड दैट लुक्स ग्रेट दैट्स माय फेवरेट एंड अगेन हियर वी हैव क्रोम इन ब्लैक एंड दिस इज दिस इज हैज अ लिटिल मेटलिक मेटालिक फिनिश एंड दिस वन इज इन सिल्वर and chrome and this one also looks good but my personal favorite i would say is the red one with white stripes on the tank that looks marvelous so let's take a quick walk around the first thing that we see here is it has an aluminum alloy wheels and these are i think from the pirelli brand the size is 100 by 90 18 inch at the front with fiber display and we have this beautiful black uh, fork circular headlamps with chrome bezel and we have twin pod instrument console let me show you here again okay. this is for the fuel this is rpm and this one is for the speed so it turns like this somewhat like the java but it's completely different and we have this side stand indicator here that shows that the side stand is uh is still active bike is in neutral okay i will turn it off here we have a usb socket you can connect your cell phone and charge it and you have your usb connector here as well the mirrors are blacked out so it looks good beautiful and here we see the these small tiny led indicators unlike the java which has a uh, bigger indicators but this one looks very cute and very minimalistic on the tank you have this beautiful engraved uh, bsa logo that is is heritage design and it is fantastic it looks amazing the chrome is beautiful and these stickers these are not actually stickers these are hand painted hand painted just like java and we have this beautiful stripes on the tank that makes it feel more sporty but the uh, fuel cap is on the right hand side is the offset a little bit unlike any other motorcycle which has the fuel cap here but it's a little bit offset and with a bsa logo the handle bars are also blacked out that looks good very contrasting the seats are very proportionate and very comfortable it's the cushioning is enough for a long distance riding and the pillion seat is also large enough for a comfortable ride and what you notice here is there is a union jack here on the strap that reminds you that this is a kind of the british heritage motorcycle but it's made in india at the back we have this beautiful retro classic looking uh, tail light from lumax brand and uh, small indicators that adds to its uh, very minimalistic feel and here we have got a number plate uh, uh, number plate holder and the rear fender is very uh, smooth and curvy just like any retro motorcycle but it's not chrome it's a uh, it's a body colored it's a painted one the rear tires are actually uh, also from pirelli and uh, it's 160 by 70 into 17 inch as you can see here and these are aluminum alloy wheels in aluminum finish not in chrome but it has spokes so it looks great and very very uh, retro style the rear shock absorbers doesn't have uh the gas charging mechanism it's a very simple but very very effective and a great work horse suspension so this is what it should be 
the foot packs in these bikes are really good like when you turn it off you get to hear this click sound so that makes you feel like a premium bike and it is indeed a super premium segment but this one is a fixed one so it turns but it doesn't get stays there now this is the uh, uh, silver variant with chrome fenders as you can see this has a chrome fender and uh, it is also has um, this has a dual ch channel ABS and it has at the back as well so to give it a more better stopping power so this one is my second best favorite and this bike looks so good so eye catchy and it 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 actually evokes the memories of the past from the 1950s and 60s bike so this one is available now for sale and it's a made in india bike with a very strong british heritage if you want this bike if you like this bike reach out to the uh, classic legends and book this bike at a price of 10000 rupees only now talking about the uh, engine this one has a 650 cc single cylinder rotax uh, four valve engine and uh, it's of course a cam operated but the design of this engine somewhat looks like it's a push rod actuated but it's not the case it's a it's a rotax design it's a very reliable engine it has a huge exhaust as you can see of course it's a 650 cc so the exhaust would be thicker and this is the same engine which is used by many uh, companies like bombardier and bmw this is the same 650 cc engine which has a lot of uh, torque and instant power delivery so it is not going to disappoint you if you ride it on the highway or cruise it on the highway this engine does it works brilliantly and we have this engine as a fuel injected so this engine was actually bs3 compliant when rotax gave it to uh, classic legends later on classic legends detuned the engine and made it bs6 compliant so since the engine has been uh, detuned to deliver more torque it delivers good amount of power close to more than 40 horsepower 40 bhp which is strong and powerful enough to cruise in on the highways and at the same time it is very comfortable enough for the daily use as well and this engine is a liquid cool engine you can see this huge radiator here so classic legend makes now talking about the uh, in now talking about the gearbox it comes with a five speed gearbox unlike the java models which have a six speed gearbox and uh, it looks like a split gearbox and kind of clip on type design but this one is just a cover and uh, it is a unitary construction engine and the entire engine and gearbox and entire uh, crankshaft is housed under the same uh, crank casing it's not a separate unit so it, it's a very very nicely built design very well engineered and uh, as you can see here the cover is actually a single piece you can see here it's a single piece single crank casing and it looks marvelous and this is the the gear lever is is the same like one down four up that's it so that allows you since this is a very torquey engine five speed gearbox is very nice and well thought out for this kind of bike which gives you a classic feel and at the same time allows you to cruise comfortably on the highways and can also be very purposeful for a daily use and daily commuting um coming to the price of this bike i think this would be somewhere priced around uh, close to 3 lakh rupees a uh, slightly up slightly down um ex showroom now including the registration and insurance it will go slightly up so it depends upon which variant you are choosing because i i believe these are four different variants and the red one is my first choice the silver one is my second choice it depends upon the price like uh, 
there may be some difference between the price of these four variants i am exactly not sure but i am assuming that it should be uh, the price difference should be around 10000 between each variant so all these four variants suppose if you are choosing this one this will be a slightly higher price than that one and the lowest price variant would be i think this one so as of now there is no surety on the price is yet to declare so if you like this video please subscribe my channel and wait for the next video on the bsa and java bikes until then have a wonderful day ahead and goodbye